Alright, but now that I'm done talking down this uh, K level, and how easy it is, in theory, it's still pretty tough. Like, it's probably tougher than a lot of levels in the game. Here's Ruined Roost. Our third boss battle. I'm actually... I'm actually uploading World 2's boss level today when I'm recording this, so I really needed to record. <laughs> I'm glad I got this in. This is probably one of my shorter recording sessions, too, because this, this world didn't have as many... This world didn't have as many levels. Anyway, here's Ruined Roost. I don't think that's this guy's name. You gotta use the bombs that he throws, throw them back at him. I feel like I'm fighting Mauser from uh, Super, Mario, Super Mario 2. Super Mario Bros. 2. Anyway, throws bombs back at him. Okay, I got another hit in there. Probably wasn't even expecting that. I don't know how many bombs this, takes, this guy takes, maybe like six. Just watch out, he'll throw missiles, this will destroy uh, these blocks here. Uh, he'll also throw bombs that have a... I want to say they're like napalm. Nah, those are walking time bombs there. Nah, he got me. Uh, but when he does that uh, dive bomb attack, that's when you want to duck. Ah, oh, he got me again. I'm not paying attention here. Oh, he gives you hearts too, I didn't even realize that. So just duck when you dive bombs so you can avoid them. And then throw a missile again. And there's a little walking time bomb. Okay, you wanna wait till he throws the bombs. Uh, the bombs that have the. that are just like black, like right away. Uh, there we go. Oh, I got hit, but I got a heart back. This is man, I, this guy was a lot easier the first time I fought him. Maybe I screwed with his pattern when I like hit him at like an extra time. Or maybe when I just fought him he decided to give me an easier pattern. Come on. I missed again. I'm getting worried I might die here. Yeah, I died. Fudge! That was tough. He was a lot tougher, or a lot easier. Okay, I, I can just skip this scene now. Alright, let's not screw this fight up again. Well, at least with me dying, the episodes will get kind of longer. Alright, I'm gonna try to hit him with all of the bombs. Okay, I missed with that one. Okay, I make sure I don't get myself hit with it. I took a hit there. Hit him there. Hit him there. Oh yeah. He's probably like, what the fudge? How did you hit me so many times? Going for a speed run. There's time trials of this too. Missile. Man. Oh, that's a regular bomb. I can use I can use that one too. Use Diddy's jetpack here. And this is proven a lot easier than last time. I think I took a hit there, but he ran right into the bomb. Man, that was a lot simpler. Yeah, apparently you can uh, beat him down whenever you just have to wait to shake the Weave Remote or the prompt doesn't come up. Interesting to note. I hit second in that time. It's all I can ever seem to do is 22. That must be the max. Or either that or I'm just not doing it right. Alright, well, music gallery, diorama gallery updated. We got some images to look at. We're done with the ruins, but of course, at the end of each world, you know I take a look at the different artwork we unlocked. And that splits because we destroyed the guy, I guess. Let's take a little in a little look into what our next world is, the cave. Rickety rails. Alright, well we're gonna be taking that on next. Let's back out here. And let's uh, 
quit game and show you the different artwork that we unlocked. Once it goes back to the title screen here anyway. Alright, game three. 98 lives. Of course I had to die, right? Yeah, of course. Alright, image gallery. Let's check out what we got. Oh, a whole bunch here. Alright, so a couple new enemies here. So those are stilts. I guess without without the bamboo sticks, they're still called stilts. Humzy. We didn't we saw them for the they were in button bash. We didn't really see them a lot. I took care of them pretty fast. Oh, here's the itty bitty biters. They're called Cageberry in Pals. Cageberry? That doesn't make any sense because there's multiple ones that aren't in cages. Anyway, here's the scurvy crew. Pinching pirates. Alright, what else we got here? World's Gallery. Oh, well, I got one new one. The Ruins. You can see the little DK there. That's pretty cool. And then we got the Kong Gallery. What's uh, in here? Oh, this is the Wii Remote I was talking to you about. The DK holding the Wii Remote. <laughs> Alright, and then we can take a look at the Diorama. What does the Ruins Diorama look like? Maybe this one will have the boss in it. Uh, nope, it has... Let's zoom in here. DK falling down a little platform. Got stilts. Got one of those cages. Oh, look at them. See, if you look close enough, you can see stuff like that. Little cage berries. Uh, they're, they're in the mouth there. Oh, there might be some other stuff if you look around. Yeah, see, look, there's one hidden right there. See, I really like that. Alright, guys, that's it for Donkey Kong Country Returns for today. See you next time for World 4. Until then, bye bye.